Hello everybody, my name is Kevin McMahon with Bear Creek Honey and you're watching another episode of Adventures in Beekeeping. Uh, this is the mated queen check um, day for, um, well actually a lot of my nukes, but I'm just going to show you one hive um, that was drew the most interest from my followers. Um, that's the, uh, this is, if you remember, this is actually the the hive that I gave it, I uh, cut out a uh, queen cell from this, from a frame from this hive right here uh, with a Dremel tool because I, I had plastic foundation. And uh, some of my followers thought it was, uh, you know, neat, but they were waiting to see. Some of them didn't think it was going to work, but uh, uh, it did work. She did hatch. I never found her um, after it was hatched, but I found the released. Uh, queen cell with the hole in the bottom and so that told me that she was in here There's, there was just so many bees in this hive it was just very very hard to locate her and I didn't want to give her but we're um, roughly well we're probably yeah we are I guess today's the 26th um, we're probably 10 days past it uh, I think today's the 26th I, I lose track of time anyways um, we're probably 10 days past it she should be out mated and back already maybe not laying quite yet maybe she has but we're going to give it a check uh, if she number one did she come back uh, and number two has she started laying but if she comes back i'm going to attempt to catch her mark her put her back and let her do her thing so um so let's get uh let's get started here as soon as i can find my smoker Hard part about this is that even though this was a nuke, there was, you know, there was so many bees. I had to uh, add a second box to it, and then I brought up some uh, some brood frames up uh, and and uh, checkerboarded it a little bit. So it's going to be a little difficult to find uh, to find her, I think, today. So, uh, but we're going to try. We're going to give it our best shot. Uh, I've been gone for a few days. Um, I filled this up on. Friday before I left and today is um, Monday so they've gone through uh, a pint of uh, nectar in just a few days Let's see what we can find, huh? All right. Well, one thing I'm going to do before I start this is the only way I can spot eggs is if I have my uh, my goggles on. So I'm going to. Slap those on real quick and I'll be right back. Okay, let's see what we can see. Maybe we'll find her, maybe not.
probably the last chance to find her. See if she's on this frame. There she is, son of a bitch. Well, she flipped over to the other side. She's a little shy. So I hope I don't. There she is. Okay, let me get her like right. There she is, right there. See her guys? She's very, very shy. So what we're gonna have to do Very, very shy. All right, there she is. Finally, she's somewhere where I can get a hold of her. Okay. We'll edit this out for clarity of time. Okay, I kind of had to walk away from the thing, but you can kind of see her in there. She's marked. I am just uh, giving her a little time to dry. Okay, she climbed back in. That was an odd reaction by all these bees. They they went in there. They got aggressive towards her after I after I marked her, which is a little odd to be honest with you. I was not expecting that a bit. So if you've ever experienced that before, if you've ever experienced that before, um, you know, let me know what uh, what your thoughts are on it. That was I saw a bee actually in there and. 
it, her abdomen was in there stinging the queen. It looked like to me anyways. I, uh, I did not expect that one bit. I mean, I literally had her out of the cage for what? A minute, maybe? And I put that pink, uh, or the, the red uh, paint on her back. And uh, I was not expecting that. Now I saw her crawl in there. And um, I'm gonna be honest with you. I kind of want to see what uh, what they're what, if she's still <laughs> if she's still walking around in there. I really do want to see that. I hope they didn't kill her because that's their last chance. These are freaking weird, man. She's not walking around much. See her? See her? See her ball? But see them balling her up there? I don't know what the deal is there, but that ain't good. They might end up killing her. They've got her cornered in the corner and she can't walk around. She is trying like hell. I might have given her a death sentence. Let's see if you can see that. They are up here in the corner here. They got her all balled up, see that? They really don't like that pink paint at all. They don't seem to be stinging her, so that is a good thing, but they really don't like that pink paint on her, or red paint. I don't think I've ever seen that before after I've painted her. I'm gonna be honest with you, I think she, she's dead. I think I just killed my queen. Well, that was certainly unexpected. See if I can. Uh, I don't think so, but that's too bad. Well, we'll have to check back in a week and see what happens. I might have just killed this colony.
That was, as they say, totally unexpected. And something I didn't want to see. Never read about that in the beekeeping books, do you? Okay. Well, that as they say is that. So until next time, happy beekeeping and I hope your experience is better than this one. <laughs>